Welcome in my math party people. Let's go ahead and crush some mental math subtraction style. That way you can learn how to save time on calculating and not get anxious so much when it comes to word problems. So here we go. First things first, let's go ahead and dive on in. We have 37 minus 18. So most people, to be sure that they're doing it correctly, they'll go ahead and start writing it out, minus 18, and they'll, they'll do their thing. But I'm gonna introduce you to this idea called splitting and gluing. It's mental math and it's gonna help you out in terms of keeping your confidence and knowing that you're good moving forward. Here we go. So we have 37 minus 18. What's an easier way to do this? Well, what if I just subtracted 20? But what would I have to do after? If I subtracted 20, that's much easier. But notice that we're actually supposed to be subtracting 18. So if I subtract 20, I'm taking away two numbers too many. So let's do this. If I subtract 20, I'm gonna have to add two back. Think about how easy that looks if you actually play it out in your head. 37 minus 20 is 17. Add two back, that's 19. You can get that done, again, very quickly, very quickly, and it's gonna give you the advantage of saving time so you can focus more on those word problems. So let's go ahead and take a look at number two. Number two here, 92 minus 37. Let's try it again. What's a nearby number that's gonna make life a lot easier for us? Let me just go ahead and take away 40. But I recognize that if I take away 40, I'm taking away three too much. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and take away 40, but then add three back. Four, or 92 minus 40 is 52, add the three back is 55, and we're done. There it is. Don't believe me? Use a calculator, check my work, call me wrong, call me out, and then enjoy it for yourself. So then next up, we have 72 minus 43. So for this one, are we gonna go ahead and subtract 50, then add seven back? No, not at all, not necessary at all. What we can do is we can just go ahead and subtract 40, then subtract three. Try it out. Look, if I take away 40, then take away three, that's the same as taking away a total of 43. Notice how we have a difference here where we took away and added some back versus here where we can just take away two smaller numbers. Take away 40, that's gonna be 32. Take away three again, that'll be 29, and we're done. So booyah, my party people, 29, and we're set. Next up, again, and if you're enjoying this, make sure to leave a comment on this video. That way you tell us that what we're doing here works for you and we'll continue pushing more out just for you. So with that said, everybody, we have 76 minus 28. How do we do mental math here? Let's take away 30, but then add two back because we're supposed to take away 28. So if we take away 30, we have to make up for that and add two back. So here, 76 minus 30 is gonna be 46, add the two back, 48. Yeah, it works. <laughs> it absolutely works, my party people. Let's go ahead and tear through the rest of this. 54 minus 37, let's just go ahead and take away 40, that's gonna be 14, add the three back, that's 17. Again, give yourself that opportunity to excel, not by learning all these crazy things, this is something that you can do right now. Everybody knows how to do simple addition and subtraction and all mental math does is it leverages your opportunity to break down something complicated into smaller steps. That's all it is. And if you can break it down into smaller steps, you can keep it in your head and get the right answer. So at this point, my part of people, let's go ahead and take care of the next one, 82 minus 14. What do we do? We can just take away 10 then take away four. Take away 10 is 72. Take away 4, 68, and we're done. Just subtracting twice in this case. You could also try subtracting 20, then adding 6 back. 82 minus 20 is 62, and then add the 6 back is 68. Either way works. Either way. 66 minus 29. I'll just take away 30 and add one back. So that'll be 36 plus 1 is 37, and we are good. So hopefully this is helping you out, my party people. Go ahead, try these out before I get started on them because um, at this time, I want to make sure that you know about this Monday's upcoming ASVAB class. We host a free class once a week and you deserve to be there with me so you can raise your score without all the hassle of trying to find the right study partner for you. I've got your back, my party people. It's a free class once a week and it includes my free practice test 
so you can watch those video solutions and then learn from every mistake. Stop memorizing questions, hoping they'll be on the test, and join me for a free class and get that free practice test right now. It's gonna be in the description of this video or my profile. That way, you can raise your score for free and get that job you want. So next up, we have 91 minus 35. Here, we can just take away 30, take away five, or, add, or take away 40, and then add five back. Either way is fine. So I'll just go ahead and take away 40, and then add five back. 91 minus 40 is 51, add five back is 56. That's how it's done, my party people. Next up, 68 minus 47. How we can do this, subtract 50, add three back. So that's gonna be 68 minus 50 is 18, add three, 21. I'm telling you, it is, and it can be that straightforward. I know I'm going fast, but you can absolutely get to the speed with a little bit of practice. Next up, we have 49 minus 62. Okay, well, the answer here is gonna be negative because we're taking away more than what we have. So if you wanna see a negative video, we're gonna talk more about that. Again, just leave a comment, I got you. So here, 49 minus 62, we can just flip it in reverse. 62 minus 49. That's gonna end up being 13, but a negative 13. And so the way that I did that was just I took away 50 and added one back. Take away 50 is 12, add one back is 13, but it's gonna be negative because we're going the other way, taking away the bigger number. So we're gonna have negative 13. Next, 39 minus 18, no mental math needed because 39 minus 18 doesn't force you to borrow one anywhere, no. We can just take away the 18, that'll end up being 21, we're good. So mental math is just as much about knowing when to use mental math to save time. Next up, 93 minus 78, just take away the 80, add two back. So that's gonna end up being 13 plus two, 15, and we're good. Next up, 45 minus 38. Hey, look, we can just go ahead and take away the 30, then take away the eight. So 45 minus 30 is 15. Take away the eight, that's gonna be seven. And again, these numbers are so close together that you don't even need to use mental math. You can just notice there's seven numbers away if you had enough practice. And so for this last one, 83 minus 47, Take away 50, add three back. So 83 minus 50 is 33, add three back is 36. And that's it, my party people. There it is. So mental math, it does not have to be as hard as a lot of people make it out to be. It's really truly all about thinking about what you already know how to do in simpler steps. Break down something big into two smaller steps Give yourself the opportunity to keep it in your head when you can, which overall will save you time. You want all the time you can to solve these harder word problems, but if you're not using mental math, then you have to take more time calculating, which means you have less time to set it up. So with that said, everybody, I love y'all. You know we're trying to ace the ASVAB here. So help me reach more people just like you by leaving a comment on this video before we move on. And again, we do have a free class coming up this coming Monday. So make sure you sign up, show up so you can raise your score and get the job you want. As always, Coach Anderson here. Love y'all. And I'll see you in the next video. Cheers. Thanks for watching my ASVAB party people. But do yourself a quick favor. If you like these videos, well then why not just join me for a free class once a week? Again, it's free for two hours so I can help you raise your confidence, get that score where you want it to be so you can enlist in the job you deserve. My party people, I'm Coach Anderson. Sign up, show up, and let's ace the ASVAB.